This is Baker High School Day, empty and damaged. This is what it could look like soon. Wednesday, the Baker School Board found out their loan application from the USDA to make that happen is nearly approved. Youth group leader Denise Stevenson is happy with the progress. So this is pretty fantastic that um, that they were able to share that much information with us and um, let us know what's going on. The USDA is expected to approve a $14.6 million loan to rebuild Baker High School. Another $6 million is coming from FEMA. The school has been empty since it was damaged in the 2016 flood. When this school was built decades ago, it was to accommodate up to 1,500 students. The new school will house up to 800 and have state-of-the-art technology. You, you need the bandwidth, you need the technology, you need open learning spaces. Superintendent Dr. Herman Brister says all those things and more will be included in the new school. He says the $22 million project won't cost you more. We're not going back to the taxpayers for a bond issue or a sales tax, we are actually being good stewards of the existing revenue that we're currently getting. The USDA loan won't get approved until a construction document is updated. Stevenson is ready. All around a great day for uh, Baker because we're going to grow our students and we can grow our citizens as well, our city as well.